Hi guys, and welcome back to this active campaign series. My name is Remus, and I'm the CEO and owner of Venti. We help businesses automate mundane tasks so they have more time to focus on their business and customers, and they just get a lot less stress because they don't have to focus on the boring and repetitive tasks. We create digital robots that take care of that for them. Uh, in this tutorial, I'm going to talk about active campaign reports and how you will be able to create reports so you can see how your campaigns are performing. Maybe you want to tweak uh, stuff around, uh, deal reports, everything around that. So I'm going here to the reports tab. And obviously I have not sent any campaigns from this sandbox account, but uh, as soon as you do, you will be able to see her open rates, uh, reply rates. So all the stuff, that you track. This is why it's so important to have those uh, on off buttons switched to on when you create the campaign. You have campaign performance, so you can just, obviously it's not something that I have here because I don't have any campaigns, but you will see a lot of performance reports around that. You have automation reports, like uh, how many people went through our automations. Again, like, even if visually you cannot see anything because uh, this account is a sandbox account, you you can go back to this video as soon as yours account is up and running and you will be able to to, to, to match the data that you see with a voiceover on my video. Uh, so again, you can under automation reports, you can see uh, how well your automations have have performed. Goal reports is how many how many goals have been reached inside your automations. Contact reports is like contact trends. Uh, this is the only thing that I have. <laughs> How many contacts a day I have? Uh, the open, the re open and read trends. You can see opens, opens by weekday or by hour. Email clients. So, for example, they all use Apple Mail or they all use Gmail or you know stuff like that. You can have nearby contacts. You can have form performance. Tag trends. Obviously, so you can have all of this deals. So, for example, what's the funnel? What's the total? Uh, how much money have you made? Um, who are the best closers in your team? Right? Who are the most deal owners? Uh, what's your sales forecast? What's your sales performance? Um, what's your marketing revenue? Fill breakdown, conversion, attribution, web personalization. If you use Active Campaign site. Uh, chat conversation report and what I wanted to to reach is custom reports. You can create this very highly customized report inside Active Campaign. You can have here, as you can see, again, I don't have any data, so I'm, I don't have anything to show you here, but you can choose to create a highly customized reports. This is not for everyone. I highly recommend you hire a developer to, to create this for you because it's a bit more complex. But if you have the knowledge, you can uh, compare it to a Google Data Studio report. It's, it's very granular and it helps you sort by pretty much anything that you, you want to. And you can create visualizations, filters, data, like all of that stuff. It's, it's really, really, really cool. And this is a custom report. Again, this was a report section, obviously not a lot about it because it's pretty straightforward, but here is where you can see how your active campaign account is performing overall, and you can get meaningful insights and actionable insights, actually. Uh, I'll see you in the next video, and till then, I hope you're gonna make a lot of sales and fill out those reports.